And it's never too early to start talking about spring sports. After all, Purdue men's baseball left today to head to Texas in order to start its season later this week. I was able to speak with head coach Greg Goff before the team departed, and we talked all things baseball and what he expects his team will do on the diamond this year. Purdue baseball is coming off one of the best seasons they've had since 2018. This year, the team not only looks to start off like they did last year, but they hope to end the season in a better way. In order to do that, the Boilers have been putting in the work since stepping off the field in 2022. When we got back um, from the summer and, and started the, the fall, you know, we told them we're training to win a championship. And uh, we had a great year last year, but didn't finish while we really wanted to. And uh, this year we want to put a full season together. But putting a full season together will be no walk in the park for this team. After all, they're facing off against the national champions, the Ole Miss Rebels, in the fourth week of the season. Goff says that that game, along with many others on the schedule, will be tough, but he feels his team is well prepared. For baseball, it's, it's a game of, of failure, and you got to be able to handle that type of failure. And um, I think our guys have been prepared, whether it's mental, uh, whether it's physical. I think we did a really good job in the weight room and, and things of that nature. And uh, I think they're going to be ready to rock and roll. 21 players return this year, along with 19 new additions, and they all have the same goal in mind. It's, it's a year that we have a chance to compete for the top of the league. Um, you know, we want to be in those top three or four teams. We want to have a chance to play in a regional this year. Uh, my goal is to have an opportunity to host here at Alexander at our beautiful facility. You know, those are things that uh, are coming. You know, there is no place I'd rather be than Purdue, and there's no team I'd rather coach than our guys.